All right, guys, there you go. We see them rolling out. We're gonna be headed to the area 252 in Kentucky. We're just gonna get, I do have a drone now, so we're gonna get some good drone shots. We're gonna try and get a little bit of footage of the 570 after we've got the diff. We've got a seal kit put in the diff. So that's actually what was wrong with the diff. If you've seen that footage before of us tearing it apart and putting it back together, not really a huge deal. Just a little bit of mud got into the diff. So when Dustin poured it apart, he said it was pretty dirty inside. So he cleaned it up. Uh, everything seems good. No more noise, no, rare, no more issues. It'll definitely spin all four tires like no problem on some dry ground. So I think she's good. Sorry about that, but uh, I think she's good. So we're gonna get you some footage for you guys. So stay tuned.
this is deep. See if you can get to me from the front up here. I right, just pull it around. All right, guys, you can see y'all want to know if it idled underwater. So. This is some gummy stuff. It's about waist deep, all right? So. Like if I stepped off it, I'd probably go down to my waist. Because poor weather is just about underwater. There we go. Don't worry, guys. She started right back up. She died a little bit, but she's still puttering. fixy fix on her so uh definitely gonna have to have a shower for work all right guys as you can hear it is running so i cut the video off just because i didn't know what we were gonna do we might pick it up let it drain out so what we ended up doing is uh we just started her turned her over probably probably for a minute or two a bunch of water came out the exhaust just fired right up after give her a little bit of these still got some in there but uh so there she goes, she died on me again. She'll start right back up, no issues. So, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take her home. We're gonna limp her home, we're gonna check the oil, probably gonna have to change the oil. No big deal, guys. What's a couple, uh, what's about four quarts of oil, about four oil change, we'll be fine, guys. So, hope y'all enjoyed the video. I'm not gonna hit any more mud, cause, uh, I, you know, don't want to uh, dog her too bad if she does have some water in the oil, but I'm gonna get her back to the trailer and check the oil. Jeez, All right, guys, this guy time. was about to use some dickies <laughs> to wipe off oil off the dipstick. But guys, look at this. All right, I so. I got napkins on my truck. Okay, no, just give me the microfiber. But, um, so we're sacrificing the microfiber here. But as you can see, guys, oh, it looks good. I don't see any milk to it. So we're going to. Because there's no oil in it. Oh, you put oil in it? I told you to change oil. But all right, guys, we're going to have to uh, do our little dip test here. I'll be about right back with you. All right, guys. Look, we dipped her back and she's good boys didn't think didn't think she was gonna be there for a second but hey guys we're gonna be riding in tomorrow so i'm gonna post some more footage if i get some and uh i'm gonna dip out but thank you all for staying tuned see you later